Hi everyone, this is Sherry from Planning Peep and welcome back to my channel. Today's video is going to be a haul video and I've got quite a few shops to show you guys because it's been a while since I've done a haul. And so um, yeah, we have lots of kits and lots of icon stickers to go through and let's get started. So the first shop I've got today is Honeydew Paper, and I absolutely love her kits. I've used a couple of them before, and I just couldn't pass this one up for um, St. Patrick's Day. It's so pretty and gold foiled, um, but really quick, my order did come with this little freebie, and it's got a lot of food stickers with like little kawaii faces, and I totally love food stickers, so this is right up my alley, and I'm really excited that she sent this. And then here is the kit that I got. Um, this is called Lucky Charm, and again, it's kind of themed for uh, St. Patrick's Day. I didn't get to use a St. Patrick's Day kit last year because it fell on the same week that Beauty and the Beast came out, so I opted for um, a Beauty and the Beast themed kit instead. So anyways, I was really excited to pick this up. Um, as you can see, the uh, full boxes have some gold foil. This box in the middle right here says Lucky Charm in gold foil, and we've got like a gold foil outline here and just some sprinkles all throughout. Here we have the heart checklist, which on these ones are shamrock checklists, which are really cute. Over here we have the headers and the little things. We have a lot of functional stickers like icons, a heart checklist, some flags and teardrops, a weekend banner, and then all this sidebar stuff. Here we have half boxes, and these are so cute. I think this is my favorite one with the little hearts in the corner. We've got some quarter boxes and then uh, icons like a movie marquee, TV, planner, etc. And then the last sheet is the bottom washi, and it's so pretty, again, because it has little flecks of gold foiling, and it's so pretty. It also comes with some deco here on the side, and my favorite is definitely this green I think it's green beer or maybe just like a green beer mug with like flowers sticking out of it. I love that so much. So yeah, I'm really, really excited about this kit. Um, I don't use green a lot, if ever, um, but I think it's perfect for St. Patrick's Day and I'm really excited. So this next shop is Very Jenny Co. I purchased some functional items as well as a really pretty kit. So let me just show you guys what I got. Uh, my order came with this little freebie and it has like some hand letter text stickers and then like a half box with a like bow, um, little bow with a girl on top. It's really cute. Um, I love this like shade of pink, so that's really perfect. And then I want to say that this was also a freebie, so um, I did pick up like two sheets of these marble and gold like glitter flags, I guess, or quarter boxes, and um, I just think they're so pretty. I love the patterns of the marble with the gold glitter, and then this little freebie kind of just matches this design, and it's so cute. These coffee cups are adorable. And then moving on to the kit... Um, I can't remember what the name of this kit was called, but this quote box up here says live life in full bloom. So it's probably called bloom, I would assume. And it's so pretty with like the marbling and the florals. Clearly I'm on a marble kick right now. And then it has, um, it comes with little scallop labels at the bottom. We've got the heart checklist, three coffee cups, and then a weekend banner. Here we have the bottom washi, which again is so clean and beautiful. I love that look. And then we have date covers here. And then these are just various sized washi strips with the marble pattern. Over here we have icons, heart checklists, like sidebar stuff. Um, I think it's a planner, me time sticker, bill do and payday stickers. Here we have lots of text stickers and I like the font that she uses. Oh my gosh, this is so cute, the girls night sticker. I love that. I don't even really drink wine, but I just love the look of that. I also like the date night sticker a lot and then her eight half boxes, um, more like scallop labels. And then we have the headers and the little things with some flags here at the bottom. So I definitely purchased this while she was having a sale. I want to say I got it over Christmas, like maybe the day after Christmas or something. It was a while ago. Um, I just haven't gotten around to filming a haul in a while, but um, yeah, I definitely love this kit, and I think I'm going to use it soon because the pinks are so perfect for February, so I might close off February with this kit. We'll see. These next stickers I purchased during the Planner Boss Collective sale, and I'm so, so excited about these, you guys. This is from a shop called Kea Town or Kia Town maybe even just Key Town. I'm not sure how to pronounce it correctly, but it's a shop that has been on my radar for a while. It's very unique. Um, I believe the guy who owns the shop draws all of the kits, and it's like themed off of various um, 
like Disney movies or anime, um, superhero themes. Like there's so many different types of themes and all the kits are really unique. And um, the one I picked up is Totoro. I don't know how many of you know Totoro or have seen the movie, but it's so cute. And this is a movie that I pretty much like grew up on. Um, I watch this all the time as a kid. So it has a very special place in my heart. So I've definitely been eyeing this kit for a while and I finally um, just decided to purchase it during the sale. Um, my kit came with this little freebie that actually matches in color so that was really perfect and then um, this is the deco sheet that comes with the kit and I just think it's so cute like I can't I don't even think I want to use any of these I just want to look at this forever I don't know I'm sure those of you who also love Totoro will understand um, so here is the rest of the kit let's start with the full boxes I usually like to start there we have eight full boxes here with various um, designs I love these little dust balls are so cute and then just each of the little characters the ones stacked on top of each other and then this quote here says big things often have small beginnings I don't remember if that was a quote from the movie I just it's been a while since I've seen it so I'll definitely have to watch it again um definitely like when I use this kit I have to watch the movie that week and then here we have the half boxes, quarter boxes, a movie marquee, perfect for marking when I watch the movie. Um, and then some like little appointment labels, sidebar tracker, bill due to buy, rescheduled sticker. Oh my gosh, these heart checklists are so cute. I love the like watercolor design on, on the background. We have the headers and the little things. Here we've got the two sidebar trackers, and I definitely love this one with the umbrella. We've got some sidebar stuff, another build do sticker, weekend banner, some flags. We have um, icons, and then these little circle checklists. And then the last page is the bottom washi, and I just love this so much. It's so pretty and so whimsical, just like the movie. Um, if you guys haven't seen it, you really, really should watch it. It's one of my favorites of all time, and I don't know if I'm saying that just because you know, like, I've loved this movie since I was a kid. I don't know if it's as good when you watch it as an adult. I don't know. But I just think it's definitely worth worth watching if you guys um, ever have a chance. So, yeah, that is my Totoro kit from Kea Town. The next shop that I purchased from is Strawberry Lime Designs, and I purchased her January mystery kit, which I typically don't purchase mystery kits because I like to see what the kit actually looks like. I think this might be like my second time doing that without seeing what the full kit has, but um, I don't know. I was just feeling risky that day, I guess, and just was like down to see what happens. I don't know. But anyways, my order came with this little freebie and it has like such cute little post-it notes, not even post-it notes, it's like little notes with like a tape on the top and it's so cute for marking any like reminders or to-dos that you've got. And then the kit, which is a full kit, comes with this sheet of deco stickers. It has like flowers and leaves of all different sizes and shapes and I just think that's so pretty. We've got matching glitter headers that come in the kit. And then we've got the full boxes here that are really pretty. Um, again, I just mentioned that I don't really use green. I think that's why I wanted to purchase this because I haven't used green in a while and I was just kind of, I don't know, maybe craving it a little bit. So anyways, I decided to just take the plunge and purchase this and I'm so happy I did because I think it's so pretty um, it has like this light green mint color and then paired with a dark black and the gold I just think that worked out really really nicely here we have the heart checklist icons weekend banner uh, some more icons and then sidebar stuff here We've got date covers, we have half box, oh, sorry, half boxes on the bottom, quarter boxes in the middle. We've got this really pretty bottom washi and then a lot of washi strips of various sizes. Here we have the heart checklists and then the headers and the little things. And um, since I already have a kit specific for St. Patrick's Day, I'll probably try to space it out and maybe use this in May or so, I'm not quite sure. We'll, we'll see how I feel, but I think it's so pretty and it's so different from the kits that I normally use. And so I'm excited to kind of switch things up a little bit. And yeah, that's everything from Strawberry Lime Designs. Up next, I've got some stickers from Jackson Pepper, and um, here I have the January notes page. I did also purchase a full kit from her, but I did already use it back in January. Um, some of you might have already seen that plan with me. Uh, I couldn't wait to like haul the kit before I used it, so I just I just went ahead. And um, I'm just showing you these stickers really quick because I did purchase them already, and I do have them. Obviously, I never got around to planning my notes page in January. Um, I haven't done my notes page in like, quite some time I think 
ever since the school year started, it's just been like so busy. I haven't really had time to plan as much as I'd like. And so I think I kind of like got some motivation at the beginning of the year. I was like, okay, I'm going to get back into it. But I just unfortunately haven't been able to. So obviously I still have these stickers. They haven't been used. Um, her little notes page kits comes with like a, a banner for the month, which is so gorgeous. It comes with the four circles to fill up like the four circles here on the notes page and then some headers. It has, let's see, I think it's the next page. Um, this is like a whole box here that I think will, is supposed to go at the bottom here and this space and then we've got lots of deco here for really just decorating and anything you want so um I haven't played around with this like format very uh, very much I think I've only done one spread with this like circle format but um yeah I think my plan to try to get back into it hasn't really worked out but I definitely still wanted to show you guys the kit in case you guys are interested in her monthly notes kits the next stickers that I purchased are from White Deer Stationery, and I also got these quite a while ago, I think like back during Christmas when she was having like a Boxing Day sale, and I got one kit, uh, a foil sheet, and then some little icons, so we'll just dive right in. So the freebie that came with the kit is um, has like three foiled sticker, which is super generous, and a really pretty like floral deco, deco sticker, and then six like um, glitter header strips of different colors, and I think this color pattern is so pretty. And then, let's see, I'll start with the icons. I got a sheet of these little crock pot glitter stickers. I think they're adorable. I got sleeping mask stickers and then laundry stickers. Um, I think she might have sent this as a little extra because I don't remember purchasing that. Um, this goes with the kit. Okay, and then the foil sheet that I got has these really, really pretty bow um, checklists. So they come in two rows of three heart three bow checklists and then two rows of the six bow checklists and as you can see they're super super gold foiled and really pretty and then the kit that I picked up I really really like um here is the deco sheet that comes with the kit it's super pretty I really like this little um dream catcher and then um here's the kit it's actually in glossy which I don't prefer but I think if I remember correctly she had run out of the premium matte ones so um I just went with glossy that was totally fine so here here is the sheet with all of the full boxes. This quote box here says free spirit, wild heart. And then we've got this like little teepee um, box that I think is really pretty. This might be one of my favorites with like the blue and rose gold rose. I think it's so gorgeous. Then we've got the half boxes, weekend banner icons and sidebar stuff. We've got the headers, little things, and then some more sidebar trackers and flags. And then here we have the bottom washi with some washi strips. And this sheet actually is in premium matte. So the other sheets are on glossy. And oh my gosh, I just love this paper so much. I wish I was able to snag that in. Um, I was able to snag the kit in this, in this format. And then the last sheet here is the heart checklist. And this is also glossy. So yeah, that is all of... Um, those are all the sheets that come in this really pretty kit. I love this style and I just love how clean it looks. And then I've got just my little um, sheets, my little icons. Oh, sorry, everything's flying everywhere. Okay, I got everything. All right, so that is everything that I got from White Deer Stationery. The next shops that I'm going to be showing are shops that I purchased some icons from. And the first one is Paper and Milk. Um, Denise is the owner of the shop and I love her stickers and I really enjoy her just kind of as a friend. We've gotten to know each other a little bit um, over the years. And um, anyways, I purchased a few really cool stickers from her that I'm excited to share. She did also send along quite a few extras. As you can see, this is a big stack. So thank you so much, Denise. That was really, really sweet of you. Um, the first sheet I've got here are these burgers and fry stickers and they're so cute because the burgers burger um, is in the shape of like a little bear. I got a sheet of these game night stickers featuring Maru the marshmallow and he's so adorable. Um, I do like to play board games with my friends and so I thought that this would be great to mark those with. Um, I got a sheet of these Coffee Monday like hand lettered stickers. I got sleep in stickers. These are ones that I saw her use um, in her plan with me videos and I just love um, the way that they look in her planner so I definitely wanted to pick some up myself. Um, I got a sheet of these cat stickers with Maru the marshmallow again. This is so cute. I love this one with the three cats all surrounding it. I wish I had three cats. Um, I got a sheet of these running shoe stickers. I have the sheet of makeup. I think she sent along this one. I might have purchased it. I can't even remember what I got anymore, 
but it's super cute. This looks just like my Naked palette, but um, has like less colors, obviously, but that's kind of what it looks like. Uh, we've got a sheet of Hiking Maru's, and it's super cute. I really like this one with the hills and the sun. I actually don't really hike very often, but um, if I ever do go, I will definitely be ready with these stickers. Oh my gosh, these are so cute. Valentine's Day stickers. Oh my gosh. Wow, that's really adorable. Ooh, I also got a sheet of these Chinese New Year stickers, which is perfect because today, Friday, is actually the Lunar New Year. So I'll see if I can incorporate some of these things into my planner. These are so cute. Um, I got a sheet of these like groceries, really adorable, kawaii groceries. Oh my gosh, I love this. Japanese food, sushi, and rice bowls. Of course, that's totally up my alley. And then this one is so funny. Uh, she sent this one along, and I love this. It's Maru the Marshmallow burning in fire, and it says, this is fine. And that's pretty much how I felt this entire school year, so that's perfect. Um, and then this one is a collab between Paper and Milk and Carly Cat Plans, and it's just hand-lettered um, holidays that you can pull in. And I actually just missed Valentine's Day. I wrote it in myself, so I can save that for next year. And then I've got all these other ones that I can use that I'm so excited about because whoever did this hand lettering, it looks amazing. I'm obsessed. So yeah, that is everything. I'm sorry if you can hear kind of a noise in the background. I'm running the laundry. And so it's kind of loud. Um, I don't know if my phone will pick it up, but um, if it does, I apologize. And yeah, so that's everything I got from Paper and Milk. Up next, I've got some stickers from Plans with Vanessa, and the shop owner, Vanessa, has become a good friend of mine, um, and I definitely wanted to support her when she was having her one-year anniversary sale. It was really exciting that her shop has already come a whole year because um, I remember talking to her about it last year when she was like thinking about doing the shop and starting it, and then, um, wow, it's been a whole year, and it's been really great. She has some awesome stickers. I use them all the time, as you guys probably know. So she sent along this really, really cute little um, post-it notepad, and this is from Wonton in a Million, featuring her little like soup dumplings and other dim sum characters. Vanessa said she found this in New York, like in a shop, so I thought that was super awesome that Wonton Mil Wonton in a Million um, is selling like in an actual shop. I think that's so cool. And then uh, my order came with this little freebie that has a bunch of her cute little food stickers as well as this little cat butt, which is adorable. Um, I got a sheet of these Poke Bowl Lover stickers because I do love to eat pokey. I know it's pronounced poke. That's what I've learned, but I've, I feel like I've said pokey for so long that it's just kind of stuck with me. And I also named my cat that. But anyways, um, it definitely has all these like fish stickers. Um, I got a sheet of the Curry Lover stickers because I do um, enjoy eating curry. Uh, the real reason why I had to make a purchase was because I ran out of my tacos and burrito stickers. Um, and so I asked her if she could make a full sheet with like just tacos and then just burritos. And she was so sweet and was able to do that for me. So I definitely have um, a lot of those now. I got a sheet of the Pizza Lover stickers, which are awesome love pizza. I got some music stickers because I do occasionally play piano. I used to, um, I used to play a lot when I was in high school and, um, I don't really practice that much anymore, but I thought maybe having stickers would motivate me to practice more often. Uh, she sent along this what's for dinner sticker and it just is like hand lettered. Um, and then I've got some, uh, coffee lover sticker here. I think she also sent that along, but that would be like perfect for Valentine's day or something. She also sent along this Let's Eat sticker, super cute. We've got shopping bag stickers that she sent, and these are cute. So the inside of these shopping bags says, um, sale, shopping, parentheses again, broke AF, and then, yeah, I think that's it. And then these ones on the bottom don't have any text. So funny. These next stickers are her dinner stickers. I love these because you could just write down what you ate inside the box. And then she sent me along um, these taco stickers. And it's tacos with the text next to it. So love that as well. Thank you so much for all the extras, Vanessa. That was so sweet. And yeah, I love her stickers. They're super affordable. Um, the doodles are super cute. So definitely check that out if you haven't already. The next stickers here are from Tickled Pink Planning, and this is a shop that's new to me. I actually discovered her through Jasenia from the Planner Sophisticate. I noticed that she was using stickers from her shop, and I just love her stickers because, as you can see, everything is just in this beautiful shade of light pink that actually totally matches my nails today, which is exciting. So this is a sampler that came in my stickers, and it features a few different characters doing different things, as well as a laptop and a paperclip sticker up here in the top. And then I got a full sheet of these 
computer stickers are super cute and come in two different sizes. I got some of these uh, pillow stickers to mark like sleeping in or having to sleep early or anything like that. They're super cute. Uh, I picked up a sheet of these little banner stickers and it's got like a bow on the top corner. I think that's so cute. I got some shopping stickers and then I decided to pick up two sheets of these uh, epic bow samplers and so basically it has a sampler of I think almost every single sticker that she has in the shop I just I just figured some of these things I don't need a lot of I probably just only need the one like for example the dentist sticker I only go to the dentist like twice a year so I don't need a whole like sheet of those so this is like really perfect and um the doodles are just really cute and I love these like the mailbox and she's got this like water bottle, the cupcake, this girl with the hair. Um, I don't know. She just has a lot of different variety of stickers, even a weekend banner here at the bottom. So I just really like the sampler. So I thought two would be great. And then um, this is really interesting. I've never felt sticker paper like this, but the back is, I don't know what this is like plastic maybe. I don't know. I think the actual stickers are like maybe a matte or like a premium matte, but the back is just really interesting. I've, I've never had sticker paper like that. So anyways, that is everything from Tickled Pink Planning. The last shop that I purchased from recently is Love Shira, and I absolutely love her stickers because she has like the best hand lettering. Her writing is so perfect, and I love pulling them into my planning. And um, the first thing that came in my order was this little card. It says, shopping is my cardio, which is totally true. Since I haven't been running lately, I really have to rely on my shopping to get that cardio in. And so I'm just gonna stick that up here with all my cards. And then um, I just made a, so a small purchase, oh, and it also comes with this little, like pretty um I don't even know what it's called like lace designed paper um anyways I did make kind of a small little purchase because there's just a few things in her shop that I've been eyeing um the first was the sushi date sticker I think it's so cute with a little sushi on this side her doodles are also really adorable so they pair really nicely with her lettering I've got a sheet of these brunch date stickers and I love the like eggs and bacon plate that she has drawn I got a sheet of these record stickers because I um it takes me a while to do voiceovers and I actually don't have like specific voiceover stickers so I thought this was perfect with a little microphone um, I got a sheet of the Target run stickers again I love these and then uh, the date night which is possibly one of my favorites it's so cute um, the little heart with the arrow and then her writing again which is just absolute perfection so yeah that's everything that I got from love Shira and I love all of it I use her stickers quite a bit in my planning and yeah the last stickers that I've got for this haul were sent to me by one of my YouTube viewers who wanted to just send me a few things that she has in her shop. Um, her shop name is called Design Gardenia and she does hand draw all of her stickers. She's got these three little characters and she just sent me some things that I, she thought I'd like because I really like tacos and cats is what she said in her little letter which is so cute and all too true. So anyways, the first thing she sent over is this little heart shaped uh, sticker sheet and it's got like all these different types of stickers. We've got three characters and then some like functional items like this little mail icon and then some hearts uh, flowers a little drink I really like this drink sticker that is so cute and then uh, she sent me some of these youtuber sunny stickers I guess this little character's name is sunny and he's holding like a film clapper and has like a little YouTube hat on I don't know if you can tell me the YouTube hat is so cute and then uh, she sent a sheet of these little sakura dot stickers like little flowers that you could pull in just uh, maybe as decoration or maybe even like to create a checklist that'd be kind of cute and then this is the taco sheet which is adorable I love the avocados avocados are like some of my favorite things in the world and then I love that this like sunny character is standing on a chili I just think these are so unique and so fun and then the last sheet are these cat stickers which are super cute they're really large so I'm not sure that I'll be able to necessarily pull them into my planning um, my planning I usually don't take up a whole lot of space with each item just because I have so many things I always want to fit but maybe on a day where I don't have a lot going on these are just so pretty and so cute um I think my favorite might be this one where the cat's like looking away from you because because they're mad um that's totally what Pokey does sometimes if I've like picked her up and made her mad then she like will sit with her back to me and it's so funny oh and I didn't even notice here at the bottom are these little like feed meow text stickers and then with a little checkbox that you can check um if you fed your cat so I just think that is so cute and thank you so much gardenia for sending over these goodies i really appreciate that 
All right, you guys, that is it for my haul video today. Here are pretty much all the stickers that I got, and there's so much I didn't realize how much there were, but it has been a while since I've done a haul video, so I think I've just been holding on to these for quite some time. And yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video and saw some things that you like. And um, if you have any questions about anything, just leave me a comment down below. Thank you so much for watching, and have a wonderful week. Bye.